Hey everybody, Yankee Marshall here. Uh, well, actually not Yankee Marshall, just only half of that's my actual name. Uh, but I wanted to come on here today for a special reason. I wanted to remind everyone, be careful what you feed your pets. I just got an email from a viewer today. They had entered their five Yorkies in a contest, a costume contest for Halloween. They won a basket of uh, dog-related gifts. In there was a pack of treats, some bully treats. They fed them to their dogs. Four of the dogs ate them. One of them didn't. The one who didn't eat them is fine. The other four are suffering serious kidney issues because of eating them. And I think it's pretty clear when the only one that didn't eat them is the one that didn't suffer the kidney issues. They ate these treats. They had to be hospitalized. One passed away, sadly. Uh, three are in rough shape, but they will recover. And like I said, the one that did not eat any is fine. So I wanted to make people aware of this. Also, I want to say if you want to help donate to their uh, medical bills, there is a GoFundMe. I'll put a link to it in the corner of this video. You can go over and please donate to their GoFundMe to help them out. Uh, all five of their little babies got, well, four of their five little babies got sick and one passed away and now they're stuck with some medical bills and vets charge outrageous rates for pets because they know we'll pay it because we love our animals so much. So they really stick it to us, especially those of us in the gun community, because we all love our pets. So if you want to donate, please go over there and donate. But I wanted to take this moment to remind people to be very careful what you feed your pets, especially when it comes to treats. The majority of dog treats in the United States come from China. They have everything from fentanyl to melamine in them. Do not feed them to your pets. When you buy treats, Make sure it says on there, made in America, 100% American made. Now, they'll probably be a little more expensive, but it's worth it. Don't kill your dog over a few cents on some jerky treats. Now, remember, it has to say made in America. Don't fall for packaged in America, because that just means they don't put it in the bag until they ship it over from China, and then they put it in the bag here. And don't uh, fall for the little labels on there that says, oh, this is distributed by Purina in, you know, Scottsdale, Arizona, or anything like that. Because that means they got it somewhere else and then they just distribute it from there or package it there, as I talked about, in, as in uh, packaged in America. Don't fall for that stuff. If it doesn't say 100% made in America on the label and you don't go down and read stuff and you don't see exactly where it was made, do not give it to your dogs. Because like I said, they don't care. You can't go after them. These companies are fly-by-night companies that make up names to market Chinese-made dog treats under. And as soon as they kill a certain number of dogs, they just change the name in the package. So do not feed them to your, your pets, dogs, cats, anything, unless they are made in America. Uh, find yourself a, a good pet shop that sources locally made treats even. That's a lot better than buying these foreign-made treats. So... Be very careful, like I said. Also, if you want to help out this family who uh, doesn't really have a lot of money and they just got cost a lot of money for this simply because they gave their dogs a treat that they wanted to show, uh, they made a mistake. If you want to help them out, please go over to their GoFundMe. Like I said, it's linked in the upper corner. But most of all, the most important part of this video here is to make you remember, if you don't know exactly where it came from, and if that place that it came from wasn't the USA, do not feed it to your pets.